Guys, the last 24 hours has been probably the most intense moment in SEO history. Not even, what is it, retention bait. It's historical. Um, so many of these massive publishers have been clapped down in the last 24 hours. Forbes included. Forbes has been completely de-indexed. Well, not com what am I saying? Sorry. Forbes advisor has been completely de-indexed. And we're seeing what they're testing. So I'm going to be reporting that. Uh, keep watching if you want to find out more with, with what I'm seeing. And uh, hopefully by the end of the video, we'll be able to answer the question, If is partnership SEO dead? Is the partnership model dead? Um, if it is, you guys know I had a good run. Uh, I made my money. I'm glad I pushed as hard as I did. I think... In terms of what I could have done better in hindsight, honestly, not much. I think everything I found, every little hack I found in the last year has been pushed to, the, to its limits. So let's talk about that. And uh, for the next couple minutes, I'll be eating creatine plus reporting my numbers from the day before. If that ain't your thing, we respect that here. Just um, skip on ahead down below i've run out of credits for um the chapters in my in my uh in the script because i'm too cheap to pay for a new software it is what it is all right it is what it is um today i'm just going to eat this rock of a thing uh mostly because i'm running out and i kind of have to like just break it up but uh yeah here we go <clears throat> oh god hardest one yet mostly because i took that in one go like i didn't let it dissolve in my mouth oh okay sorry 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 Holy cow. Um, yesterday we did $2,040. It's down $40 from $200 from the day before. You got Amazon coming in at $988. Uh, Mediavine at 144 And the adult revenue source at 908 Massive down day. But um, yeah. Let's go on with the episode. I'll talk about it and um, keep you posted. All right, guys. You signed up for the first link in the description. You guys sent the URL to this sheet. It's very, very important that you sign up. Um, mostly because you don't want to miss out on our Humanizer software launch. Um, just a quick teaser. It's, it's only going to be for the first 100 customers where we get 50% off. Um, it's going to be huge and it's going to be lifetime. The price will only go up from here. We're obviously going to have a bring your own key option. Uh, and this is going to be a revolutionary product. So this is probably something I'm most excited about for 2024, 2025. Looking forward. I've done a market size check. Uh, we could get up to freaking like half a million MR if we capture the market. Um, Crazy, crazy. Anyways, um, if you guys want to follow along, today's episode 367. So, Forbes Advisor, Market Watch, CNN, CNET, USA Today, Business Insider, Wall Street Journal have all been clapped. Their third party subdirectories have been clapped. And what does that mean? It's been de indexed. So, Forbes. Um, <clears throat> We have insider knowledge that they do a hundred million dollars plus a year in revenue on their affiliate. A hundred mil a year. Guys, I don't think you fully understand how large of a business this is. And <laughs> this hundred million dollar a year business was taken down by a bunch of SEOs on Twitter. 
a bunch of Jimmys. I am part of the problem, probably. I am one of those Jimmys in this case that got it clocked. Imagine how upset you'd be. <clears throat> um, so what are they doing? Uh, let's let's just read over the news articles because uh, more articles came out in the last couple of days. This search engine land. I just opened it just to see what's up. Nah, don't feel very good about it. <clears throat> Here are the changes in their um, their language used for the site reputation abuse. Taking advantage of rank signals. Eh, already. Chris says it's a band-aid on a massive situ issue. Yeah, because their massive issue is they can't detect it. That if any time a trillion dollar company has to do anything manual, especially in the tech space, it's pathetic. And it's really sad that they can't figure it out. Um, it's not our, our job. Our job is technically to game the hell out of it. So uh, we're doing our job. They're just not doing theirs, which is fine. Um, we can make a ton of money in the meantime while they f get their s shit together, you know? Do you do third party involvement? SRA? No. It's like, all this isn't very interesting, but I do want to show you one thing. All right. So, at the beginning of November, Forbes started to move their high, very, very high, how do I say, high value keywords to another subdirectory because the new advisor was going to get clapped probably. They moved it to slash portfolio. Dude, do you think we're not going to find it? Like, what are you doing? All right. If you're trying to circumvent these manual penalties, you're going to get your whole domain clapped. Whoever led this should be fired. All right. You have to be careful with your domain. Forbes.com is still worth a lot of money. So if you just simply move it to slash portfolio, you're just trying to circumvent the manual penalty. So <clears throat> I mean, let's, 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 let me just show you guys real quick. All right. So forest portfolio, you see it here. How does it look on Ahrefs? Ridiculous. Um, ranks for high yield savings account. And guess what it looks like? Forbes advisor. Look at that. Would you look at that? So if they simply move the subdirectory from advisor to portfolio, it's going to start ranking. Why would you hold any stock, any Google stock after seeing how pathetic this is? So you're telling me you manually penalize advisor, you de-index them for site reputation abuse. They simply move their subdirectory to another like URL, and then you put them at number one again. What is this? What are you doing? <clears throat> Anyways, all this, I didn't find this myself. Um, shout outs to the advice member who did, John Ward. Um, John's been incredible in the advice community. And uh, yeah, we, we chat about all this stuff there. Uh, it feels good, you know, advice right now feels really good because it feels like a divide and conquer type of situation where we just share our knowledge and then it's way easier than trying to figure everything out yourself because um, someone else has tested something else. And if there was something that just requires money to test, they just set me and Sean, they're like, tag me and Sean. It's like, can you test this? Because we have 1K a month in budget just to test services. So yeah, anyways. Secret plug. Um, the advise Black Friday sale is officially live. Well, not officially, unofficially live. We have included it in one second. We have included it in our like after you apply to join the advice. If you are able to, uh, if you're in, then pretty much you'll see this. We'll send you a new URL to this. Um, payment link and the monthly subscription will automatically be 139. It'll be 149 after uh, December 2nd, but the annual subscription will be 999. So I don't know if you guys can do quick maths, but that's like four or five months worth five, 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 six months. It's six months, six months of the monthly subscription will pretty much get you an annual subscription. Most people are here for at least 10 months. 
Um, so I know like it's hard to bite 1K at a time. I, I get it. But I think the reasonable thing to do, unless you guys don't want to hustle, if you just want to get in and get out, then fair enough. But the annual subscription is where it's at because you also get other sweet stuff. Um, anyways, that's it for today. If you guys like me doing all the investigative work, I didn't do it, honestly. If you like me reporting investigative work, com comment Forbes for the algo. And uh, let me answer some questions from the day before and I'll catch you guys later. All right, quirky because uh, only channel members today because uh, we're already over. All right, thank you, James, for the chapters. Techopedia, a DR88 gambling site. Yeah, they do their own. Holly's a beast. She does whatever. She, okay, yeah. When she, YouTube Live first hit YouTube, they would instantly rank it. She would be the first people to abuse that, have hundreds of videos using custom software. That's crazy. Site reputation of the algo. Thank you. Site reputation abuse. Thank you. I would buy into advice if I could afford it, bro. Don't worry. Don't worry. Um, just remember to pay your taxes. I think your first 1K made online should go into advice. Anything before that, you're good, man. Don't worry. Don't worry. Sam, they finally got their site reputation abuse scoundrels. Love to see it. All right, guys. That's all the time I have for today. Comment Forbes for the algo. Um, buy my services that are on Black Friday sale if you can afford it, if you're in the market for it, um, right here. I think I'll also bookmark it in or pin it on the comment section. But yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow, all right?